another day and uh, see if we can get on some get onto some fish here Whew. let's get it going man let's uh let's see if we can get on some fish and uh, see if we can get your video I'll tell you guys about uh, how good the fishing is around here today and uh, see you in the water <laughs> Did you see that fish? Come on, baby. I'm gonna catch up the run here because there's a lot of activity right here. It's gotta be some this yak attack gear. This pot this uh, pole is in my way. I should have put it on this side, but then it's still gonna be in my way because of the the current. There you go, got another one. Oh yeah, baby. Look at I just got. I just picked up a flounder pounder right in this oyster here. Oh, oh, he's a slab. He's a biggin. He's a biggin. Come here, baby. Let me see you. Oh yeah. But, oh gosh. Open your mouth. God, this guy doesn't want to open up his mouth. Uh, he chunked this. He's got them sharp teeth that I don't want him to. There you go. He's head. Got this boy on the hoagies. On the pumpkin color today. Uh, I'll fix that in a second. Look at that. Look at that, folks. Oh, yeah. I got to keep him a little bit in the water because I don't want him to... I need to get him to some air. Yep, he is 18 and a half. Where is my... He thinks he's going somewhere, but he doesn't know that I'm helping him on my clip. Put that bad boy right there. He's good. He is safe for now. Thought it was a red at first. Folks, I picked up this flounder. This 18, 18 and a quarter inch flounder with this uh, with this hoagies right here. It's not fixed correctly, but anyways, I picked them up with this uh, pumpkin color. And uh, I wasn't doing it with a shrimp. I was having a hard time with live shrimp. So I resorted to hoagies. And hoagies is 1-0, baby, over a shrimp. So I guess hoagies is winning right now. Look, it tore it up. But that's all right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep using it until I can't use it anymore. All I got to do is put some taco sauce on it. And that is it. All right, bringing out the popping cork now. If not, I'll just rig something up real quick. No, 
Don't be afraid of throwing the popping cork. I'm not afraid of throwing nothing. All right. I got about a foot liter on the popping cork. And let's see. Oh, there goes. Got something. <laughs> oh, what is it? A little rat rat or something. I don't know. It took it like a like a champ, man. It took it like a champ. Oh, it's a little trout. <laughs> oh, that was fun. That was so cool. Woo! <laughs> Little trout. We'll measure him, but he's not gonna keep. He's got to be 15 inches. So I still measure him, anyways. Yeah, he's he's barely 13, 13 and a half. So folks, we're gonna let him go. There he goes, right there. All right, folks, I just had a, uh, a trout and, uh, and all I need is a red and I'll be set for a nursery slam. Um, I picked up this, uh, look at this guy right here picked him up and uh, love it on the on the uh, hoagies but it wasn't the black hoagies it was the um, pumpkin color hoagies put him back in the water oh I think that's probably gonna be it for me I'm not sure I'm gonna cast a little bit more and see if I can get a red uh, but that's my goal I've been out here for a couple of hours and uh, it's been fun I need to rig something up because I've already lost the bugs. I've already lost my hoagies, and my one of my uh, my popping cork uh, is all I have right now that I'm working with, and uh, it's too shallow here to use a popping cork. Although what I have is about 12 inches, so it's it's perfect for what I'm doing. But but still, I need to come up with a better plan now, and see if I can rig something up before the sun goes down. Woo! Well, folks, that is it. I've got about 30 minutes of daylight. And uh, I came out to do a little bit of evening fishing. Uh, ended up with a nice little um, trout. And then uh, I caught a keeper 18-inch flounder uh, on the hoagies. The trout was caught on a popping cork and shrimp, live shrimp. Uh, I finally did rig up something, but uh, I wasted too much time rigging up. Um, but as you can see, the uh, the sunset, look how beautiful it is. Ah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there. Oh, man. It was a great day of fishing, evening of fishing. So I'm going to stay in my truck. I'm going to spend a night in my truck. I got a pillow. I've got everything I need. I've got food, coffee. I've got everything and uh, I'm gonna come out here and fish in the morning. Let's see what happens. Um, a couple of friends are gonna join me, so that's gonna be really cool. Fishing with my with my kayak junkies. Anyways, um, folks, thank you for watching and uh, don't, for, don't forget to uh, give me a like and uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much, man. I appreciate you guys that have subscribed to my channel help a brother out man anyways see you in the water and peace out